Okay, everybody. So we're halfway through our September challenge of getting rid of things. And today is the 18th, which means that you need to get rid of 18 items minimum. Well, I'm gonna tell you that that's not been the way I've been rocking and rolling. As a matter of fact, once I decided to focus on this, I actually went through and did a heck of a lot more. If they were to count how much paper it was that I threw away, I think I would be way across the board, but that's not the way it works. So I wanna sort of again, throw the challenge out at you and remind you, you still have some, another two weeks to do it, but I'm gonna encourage you to do some things that you might not normally think about. So. Some of the things that happened when I had one of my friends, she says, you know what? I don't have a whole lot of stuff. And she says, I don't know that I'll have 300 items because I get rid of stuff even as soon as I decide I don't want it. Well, what I did is I said, how about in your pantry? And she goes, oh my word, what a great idea. We're coming up on the holidays. There's a lot of people right now that are actually going to be having donations out for the food drives. So even if you're in a position to where you're actually considering doing that and going through your pantry and getting anything and everything that might be close to expiring or something like that, understand, take it to a grocery store. You don't have to buy the stuff at the grocery store. They just want to collect it. So you don't make, don't make it complicated. Just take your stuff that you if you either decided that's going to possibly be something that might be expiring in the next six to months to eight months or so. You don't want to take expired food. That's not fair. But, but if it is expired, then you know what? Toss it. That counts. Another thing too that I also had somebody else, I said, go through your medications. I'm blessedly, thankfully very healthy and I hope you are too. However, one of the things that happens is, is that sometimes we'll buy something because of the fact that we need it at that time and it may be a year or two before you actually ever need that same medication again. I challenge you, go through your medications. You'd be surprised how many times that medication might have expired and then you go to use it and you think you have it. Well, you do, but it's not good to be used at that point in time. The last thing, which was something that I didn't even think about that somebody brought to my attention, I'm used to it, but you might not be, is the lions actually will take glasses. So if you're the type of person like myself who happens to have a lot of glasses, I have contacts, but I also have prescription glasses then there is a donation place at the Coast Hills branch that's in Santa Maria over by the um, by Lowe's where you can actually drop off prescription, prescription glasses. This could happen whether or not it happens to be your own or happens to be any one of your family members, but it's really nice because what they do is they recycle it. So that way you're not necessarily just getting rid of something that could be used by somebody else. So a couple more weeks left. Let's see how it goes. If you have anything that you think would be a great idea or a tip, I'd love to hear from it. Also passes on to family and friends. Even if they didn't start at the beginning of the month, that doesn't mean they can't catch up. Remember, day one was one item, day two was two items, day three was three items. Here we are, day 18, 18 items today, and let's just keep it going. I know I feel a lot better. How about you? As always, have a great day. Bye.